Good evening, internet. We're gonna play. Uh, we're gonna play some more dark wood tonight, I think. So, I think I've actually got some goals as opposed to the last time I played this, where I was just kind of wandering around aimlessly. Uh, so, silent forest. A werewolf with an AK-47 broke into my house and told me I should meet him here, but I think that's. Uh, I think that's kind of a later part of the game, so I'm not going to worry about that too much for right now. This uh, burned down house had a locked door with two people talking in it. Um, I never found a key, but I'm going to see if I can make a lock pick and maybe break in there. I'm pretty sure this is how we get to the next area of the game. And I got an invitation to some celebration down south. They said south of the cornfield. I think that's probably the thing I thought was a hedge maze, hedge maze, where I wandered in and got killed by a big fucking dog. So those are the things I'm gonna do, but before I do any of that, I wanna board up my windows. Because the last time I played this, some dude just jumped over this window. Didn't even break through it, just jumped over it. I want to make sure that doesn't happen to me again. So luckily I don't need nearly as many planks as I thought I would need to do this, but still don't have enough to get them all. Yeah. Pretty sure there were a bunch of piles of logs down south, so I'm going to go grab those and just make up some more planks. I'm gonna have to repair my glorious weapon, too. Breaks in ten hits. Oh, fucking, really? Already? Take ten steps out of my house? You gonna come at me like that? Yes. Avoid me, dog. I am merely in search of wood. Okay, I already feel like I've gone too far. I feel like they were closer than this. I may have already picked them up. Yeah, they were definitely closer than this. This is the entrance to that underground tunnel that I also died in. That's not the dog I just walked past, is it? Okay, that's concerning. I'm fairly certain I didn't kill this dog. What is this? Looks like a dead deer or something. A dead deer with gasoline. Okay, I'll take it. buddy. How's it going, pal? Your friend broke into my house. I don't like that. Oh, come on. Run him down. Don't slow down to hit him. Okay, well, like... You win this round. Slowly jaunting antler man. Oh, come on. Step on the bear trap. Step on the bear trap! Okay, fine. Just, just be like that, then. Oh, shit, I forgot to turn my generator off. I have a feeling I'm gonna do that a lot. And I actually don't need this lantern on right now, either. Assuming I actually do find logs, I'm going to need fuel to turn them into planks. And I really need planks, because mine is about to break. I 
I swear to God, there were logs everywhere when I wasn't looking for them, and now they're just a wall. And this is the place where I need to find the lockpick. So I'm gonna have to come back here later. And I am not coming back to this place without a weapon, because there is definitely something in that house. Something that quite literally told me to fuck off. Oh, been here already. I'm gonna take these pills. I don't know what these pills do. Okay, they just heal like like all the other types of pills. I think this had some shit in it before. Yes, that's exactly what I need. A random piece of wire. That's what lockpicks are made of. Ah, but I need two random pieces of wire. Damn it. Y'all have fun with that. Nope. You didn't hear me. You don't smell me. Okay. Well, if I can't find logs, I'm just going to go check out what's supposedly south of the uh, cornfield. I'm sure it's not a giant dog that's going to kill me again. I probably should just kill that dog. I don't think they respawn, and it's kind of been in my... Come on, buddy. Why are there so many dogs in this forest? I haven't spotted one bear, but dogs everywhere. Oh, man, now I need two lockpicks. Damn. Oh, right. It doesn't show me where I am on the map. But... Okay, it's next to the house with all the dogs. I'll have to remember where that crate's at. I wonder if this thing has a wire in it. Uh. That's gas. I will need that, but how much inventory space do I got? Eh, I got enough. I can take the gas. Or maybe not. Maybe the dog will, for will forget about me if I hide behind this trailer. Tractor, whatever. Nope, that, that's a scary deer. Damn it. All these things I'm going to need lockpicks for now. Alright, so this, this looks like a cornfield. There's something south of this. And it was described as a celebration. And I'm not sure I care for that nomenclature at all. A wedding? That does sound like a... Does sound like a celebration. Is this a, uh, oh, this is a combine. I've never seen it rain in this game. I mean, Oh, you're all locked up, huh? You can stay that way. You can stay that way for right now. I'll come back and kill you later, once I'm sure there's nothing else over here. Oh, God damn it! It's getting dark in here. I know being in dark places hurts you, but I think that might only be at night. Come on. 
gonna have to confront this dog, aren't I? Good boy. Do you have anything in your house? No? I'm positive there's something in this house. I don't know how I feel about spooky music like this. Like, it just gives you the illusion that something is going to happen and it's going to be either a fake out or you just know there's a scare coming. I mean... Okay, there's a spinning bride there. I mean, if something does jump out, it's still going to scare me even though I know it's coming, but I kind of would like it to be random. Lady? I'm sure I was supposed to do that. It was either her or me. She was coming right at me. You all saw it. Uh, there's got to be something here, right? I got a. Spe I was specifically invited to this place. Oh, I hear something knocking. Yeah. It better be this. Are you kidding me? Bride doesn't have anything on her. Oh man, I hope... I hope the code wasn't on that invitation. I'm pretty sure I can't look at that again. Oh. Shit, now I don't remember what it was. Sure, let's go with that. Oh. Alright, so that's just another mystery. Already checked the well. Nothing in there. I already killed the bride as one does at a wedding. Killed the bride's dog as one does at a wedding. Like, it has to be here, right? They wouldn't just invite me here and then put the combination somewhere way across the map. Like they've done for every combination I've needed to find so far. They would probably do that. What does that say? Zaprosim... Zaprosimy? Well, that's not a word. At least I don't think it is. Some dumb part of me thought, you know, a four-number combination, four tables, I'm going to move the tables and the number's going to be written on them. That was really optimistic of me. These ones don't even move. I can't just break through a window, can I? That kind of sucks. This kind of puts me at a dead end, because I'm pretty sure a lockpick won't open the door to the north. That's kind of my only other lead. And... I don't think I can make it to the Silent Forest yet, either. And... Honestly, I want to I wanna get an actual weapon before I go to that place, anyway. That place was... 
recommended to me by a werewolf who broke into my house with an AK-47. I do not, do not want to go there unarmed. Oh good, it only rains at that wedding. Isn't it ironic? That really puts a damper on that. Oh, I found a brook. Wonder if this brook has a combination to that locked wedding. Uh, if this has to just. I'm pretty sure this is just a map landmark. I don't think there's anything here. What have we here? Ah, oh, damn it. I don't know how I refuel that lantern, but I'm gonna need to pretty soon. Especially since I'm in here. Eh, could be a battery powered lantern. That's not what I wanted to do. I just broke my weapon a little bit more. Oh god damn it, come on now. Okay. Apparently this was a push door, not a pull door. can do it. You got this, you fucking champion, you. Is this just supposed to be another safe house? Because, gotta be honest, this doesn't feel very safe. I, mean, I guess I can spare some fuel for this generator so I don't use up all my lantern. So, is that it? Because it looks like there's stuff over there, but I, I can't get there. Oh shit, it's already almost nightfall. Oh, come on, dog. Oh, man. I stayed out way later than I wanted to. This is bad. Yeah, I don't know what happens in this game if you don't make it back before nightfall, but I'm pretty sure you don't survive it. Okay, that is the sound of a dog dying. That's... Sure, that's the dog that just hangs out to the south of my house, so I'm Okay, those are my footsteps. I'm sure it's on purpose, but I think a lot of the times your or like my footsteps are timed just a little off. So it seems like there's something around me. Oh, good, I left this open. And... Oh, man, 
and I didn't find any planks, I can't repair my only weapon. This... That ain't good at all. Alright, I guess we just settle in for a spooky night. A spooky night where we're 100% defenseless. Wait, I honestly have no idea what you're supposed to do if you don't have a weapon at night, because you do get attacked sometimes. And it's not like you can leave the house. If you leave at night, you will die. So I think I got maybe one good hit out of this thing left before it breaks. Oh, something's here. Oh no, please. Just go back outside. Hey, stop dimming. I should probably just, like, haul some more furniture to this house so I can block doors and stuff. Because I gotta have this one here. There's a big hole in the wall. Oh, is that the door that opened? Hi. Can I... I agree, you should get away from here. I didn't mean like that. That guy looked like he was dressed in... Okay, what's with the music cue, game? What are we doing here? Anyway, I wonder if that guy was like the groom at that wedding that I just crashed. Because he, he looked like he was dressed for the occasion. Didn't have a jacket, but... Fuck off! No! No! Fuck off! How did a dog break through here? Okay. So... Now if something else happens, I'm kinda fucked. I can scare them off with these matches. Oh wow, I can actually just light these matches. Not useful to me in any way, but. No! Bad dogs! Fuck off! I am a human. You are supposed to love and obey me. I swear this. This cabinet's just gonna get blasted into the house and they're gonna start running in. No. Oh no, I'm sorry. Oh no. Where is it? Where is it? Where is it? Where is it? Go away. Okay, I think the sun's coming up. Oh, thank God. This game does a very good job of making the nights intense. <sighs> Hello again. 
As I approach him, the man drops a sack from his back to the floor with a visible relief. I notice a smile on his face through the matte visor of his helmet. The man nods in greeting. Ugh. What do you have to say about this? Uh, all roads lead deeper into the wood. Yeah, I kind of figured that out. Alright. I need planks. I need wires. He doesn't have enough, but... Damn, really? 60? I'm gonna spend all my damn money on... Well, that stuff, but... I need to find shit to sell. I need to I need to make an axe. Cuz just these nail boards are not going to cut it. There's no point selling that shit. I'm going to get 100 more reputation tomorrow, I think. I think that's how it works. Oh God, I kind of want to watch too. Cook up this mushroom. That's how you level up, is by eating mushrooms. And this game is basically Mario. Like, one to one. Can I not repair this yet? Oh, I thought I bought planks, too. Shit. Didn't look to see how many planks I needed, so. Fuck it. Take all my reputation, I guess. Wait, no, no, no. I don't want to make a new one. I want to repair this one. Yeah, that would have cost me twice as much. What do I need to upgrade it? You can't upgrade it, but I need to upgrade the workshop. One more nail, that's it. Yeah, I'll do that. Just to see what I can make. Just to give me something to strive towards. Give me like just give me as much as I can buy. I'm gonna have to repair that nail board again anyway. Grade workshop, what do you get me? I can make a single shot pistol, Molotov cocktails, those will be good for when I'm defending my house from the inside. So I guess this is just a one time use thing that I can't refuel. I'm gonna see if I can pick the lock on this burned house up here, and if not, there's a couple of crates that I can pick the lock on and hopefully get some useful stuff. But yeah, I really want that watch though because you don't know when the sun's going down until it is about to go down. It's. Like, I got stuck in that cave. Or not stuck in that cave, but... No, I need a key. Damn. There's not one in here, I'm pretty sure. And I think... Since this is kind of the exit to this area, I'm guessing I'm gonna find that combination later. Or that key, I mean. So let's go see what's in these crates. I'm gonna check the one that was farther south by that tractor. I figure the one closest to my house just probably won't have won't have all that much stuff in it. It's like a tutorial loot box. I gotta repair that well at some point too. That lets you I'm pretty sure that just heals you like once a day. Make me waste my board on you, dog. There's that. 
corpse I had nails. I don't I don't know why I didn't take those. Ah. I really don't want to waste my nail board on you, but now you now I done just got mad. was over here anyway. I'm pretty sure it's down here though. Oh, there's a bear trap. Oh. <sighs> These fuckers better not respawn. Especially since the loot doesn't respawn either, so planks are just going to keep getting harder to get. I'll check this one. My curiosity has gotten the best of me. Wow, that was a waste of curiosity. My curiosity has doomed me once again. Well, I can refuel my generator, which I forgot to turn off again. I guess I could go back down here. I don't think there's going to be anything there for me, though. Like, I got to the end of it and basically had to leave. I died before I left, but there was nothing else for me in there, so... That's going to be my real last resort if I really can't figure out what I'm supposed to do. I have here. I'm pretty sure I have a storage chest here, actually. No, well, maybe not. Actually, did I ever... Oh, no, this is what I have. I have another thing I don't know the combination to. Here's my house. I haven't uncovered any landmarks on in this whole like section, so I'm gonna head west and see if I find anything. And if not, I'm just gonna work my way back to that brook and see if I can figure out what that place is all about. I know the camp is up here. Here's the camp. So, nothing between the camp and my house. That's good to know. I'll just try and sort of fill in the map and hopefully stumble across some hint at what I'm supposed to do. I'm sure some of it is time-based, too. Like, like, I think that guy who appeared in my house probably that's something that triggered for me going to that wedding. I'm complaining about the dogs now. I'm pretty sure there's going to be way worse shit later on. Is this another body? All these bodies just have rags on them. Oh shit, log piles. Oh shit, I don't have inventory space. That's annoying. Do I need any of this stuff? I don't need dog mate. Whoa. 
something just move over there? I swear I saw something by this log. Nothing to see here, oddly aggressive deer. Ah, yes, I found the only broken tree in the forest. Ooh, this guy didn't go out well. Awesome. Now I can make another lockpick and check that other crate. So after... I get to the brook, I'll circle back around to that farm. I think that's where that other crate was. It was by the tractor. Uh, was this the brook? No. It's just some misleading stream that makes me think it's a passway. Pathway. Oh, probably because it is. It's the pathway to the brook. Oh man, I should have turned that generator off before I left. Okay, didn't think I could go that way, but had to check. Cause there's definitely stuff over there. I saw a lamp over there earlier. And the music gets really ominous when I walk towards that area. At least there's not some dog waiting for me outside this time. Keep opening my inventory when I mean to open the map. Burned houses is where that crate and a bunch of dogs were. Damn. Let's eat this bread. I need some help anyway. my bandages. Uh, nope, stay over there. Actually, I wonder if I've even searched these houses. Because I'm fairly certain enemies don't respawn and those dogs wouldn't be wandering around there. Where the fuck did the crate go? Was that farther south? Was that at the wedding? Maybe it was at the wedding. So burned houses, that's where I'm at. was here, right? Yeah, because that's just a combine. The thing I'm looking for is a regular tractor. I don't think I actually... I didn't search the corn maze, but it doesn't look like there was a point in doing that anyway. There's a different tractor I'm looking for, then. Nope. 
Can I make the dog fight the deer? Somehow I doubt it. Check out this house. Some pills, some flares. Hmm. I haven't really used flares, but they they sell for a decent amount. I don't know if I'm gonna need rope anytime soon. I'll come back here for it if I need it. Honestly, I don't know if I need those matches either, but I know as soon as I get rid of them, they're going to be something I wish I had. Ooh. God damn it. Alright, what am I getting rid of? I need the boards to repair my weapon. I'll get rid of this. It's not an awful lot of gasoline. And I need mushrooms to level up. sworn there was a crate here. Maybe it's over this way? Oh. Oh! I found the wolf! How you doing, wolf man? Oh, cool. I have no use for them yet, but I'll need them. That, I'm pretty sure, is just something I can cook to level up. A pipe can be used as a weapon. I'm betting no, because that would be too easy. He knows about the invitation. A never-ending wedding. Well, that's not very nice. Oh, wow. And that just ended the whole conversation. Yeah, I kind of kind of figured that one, man. Yeah. It's no dancing for you. All right, well. At least there's a place I can trade some shit now without having to wait until morning. Nope, don't open your inventory. Do that. Let's just check over here. I know I'm probably not going to be able to actually make it to this place. Oh, entrance to Silent Forest. Hey, what are you? Rabbits or something? X to doubt. Okay. Are there going to be context clues for this one, or am I going to have to find it out later? There's a generator. Oh, 
Oh, there's someone in here. Need to find a way to get rid of it. Fire will do that pretty fucking quick. Yeah, that needs to be burned out. And I wish I had... Hmm. So I pretty much just wasted my fuel here. Unless I can find some stuff to make a Molotov cocktail and burn that thing out. Actually, can I burn it with this? Ah, son of a bitch, it's already getting dark. Damn it, damn it, damn it. Did I drop my matches with it? Yes, I did. I'm cutting it close with these little excursions. It's if it's not nightfall, nightfall by the time I get home, it's gonna be very close. Much too close for comfort. Okay, there's the corn maze. That means I'm close to burned houses. Darkness itself hurts me at night. So, use the last little bit. Fucking dogs hurt me at night, too. Ha! Dogs can't hop fences. deal. Is my front door open? Of course it is. I always leave my front door open. Repaired weapon. Soon to be full health. I'm about as safe as I can possibly be. Which is not very safe, unfortunately, but it's the best I got. Something moving around out there. Nope. None of that. Not getting in this way. Too far from that lamp. 
because I don't want to go over there and try and push it farther up. Because I know as soon as I walk away from this wardrobe, something's just going to burst through it. I can't imagine this is very fun to watch, but these night sections are, they're actually pretty tense. As soon as I was about to say did whatever was out there leave, it made that crack, crack, crack noise. Wait, I can just... There, get, a l get it sort of in the middle of the room. So I never have to be too far away from it. Shit, I looked away from my screen, so I don't know what that noise was. soon as I walk away. Nope. Fucking... I boarded up all the windows. I should have just made a new wall. That only takes, like, what? Four planks? God damn it, I was searching for planks and I had logs all this time. And scrap metal and batteries. And money. What else have I been hiding in here? Okay, I've got a decent amount of gas. What you got for me today? You don't want to look at the invitation, so... Ah, oh, that mushroom's almost rotten. Damn. I'm gonna see if I can still cook that. Okay, cool. It still gives me the same amount. So I have enough for the watch now, so I, at the very least, might not get too sidetracked to make it home before dark. But I really want this axe blade. What do I need to make an axe if I even can yet? I probably need to upgrade my bench again. Yeah, I can't make one. What do I need to upgrade it? The toolbox? Shit, I'm pretty sure that costs as much as the, uh, axe head does. And this guy doesn't even have it. The wolf has it. Flashlight couldn't hurt. I could probably use batteries for those. Uh, I'm gonna take the watch. Call it a long-term investment. Now, 
I need glass bottles. I haven't found any glass bottles in a while. But I want to make some Molotov cocktails. Of course you don't. Why would you have bottles? This is just good log storage, so I may as well keep some in there. Can't consolidate these, can I? That's very enough. Oh, yes, I can. I did. At some point, I'm probably going to have to drag a wardrobe from a nearby house just to have more storage. really don't need this dog meat. I don't know why I was storing it. And how much is a wire? 30? Damn. Wait. Shit. So I still need to find that crate that was by the tractor, and I would like to find some glass bottles so I can make a Molotov, because I think that's what I have to do at that uh, that house at the entrance to the Silent Forest, is just burn whatever that crap was. Nope. Not fucking with you today. Piss off, Fido. I also don't think... Shrine? Broken tractor, that's the one. So it's north of my house, not south. Or northeast, rather. I'm gonna do that. Then I'm gonna check out that shrine. It's on my map, so presumably I've found it before, but I do not remember what it is. Yeah, so that's not the same broken tractor. Hmm. I don't have any skills to use. Are there skills in this game? Checked out the east side, let's, or no, I check out the west side. Now let's check out the east side. Yeah, couldn't hurt. I should probably start trying to make some bear traps and just setting them up outside where that wardrobe is blocking the wall, because they all seem to be trying to get in there. Hmm. This, this has to be something. Ah, uh, yes. Ignore your dead friend and go back to eating. What you got for me? Alcohol! And a small caliber magazine. Damn. That's... That's a relatively hefty fine for this game. And I'm pretty 
sure I still have enough planks to repair my weapon, so I'm not too broken up about that. Sometimes to make an amulet, you just gotta crack a few dog skulls. Pretty sure how that that's how that one goes. Oh, I can cook this meat. Okay. So, keep an eye out for rabbits that aren't running away. Still concerned with this thing, because it this seems like it should be something, but I can't interact with it in any way. Or wait, is this what the shrine is? Okay, this is a shrine to something. But... I'll see if there's anything between the shrine and the entrance to Silent Forest, but then I'm gonna go back and make a Molotov cocktail. Actually, I'm just going to go make the Molotov cocktail, because I think I'm going to need it at the entrance anyway. Oh shit, I hope I turned that generator off over there so it didn't waste all the fuel. the old bait and switch <laughs> fucking saw me running and went around are you fucking kidding me dog scrap metal for right now. And I can I'll just sacrifice this wire for right now. Give myself some inventory space for the gas. Or honestly, maybe even the fabric, just because I don't have any of it. I left my fucking generator on again. Okay. What am I missing? Rags? I don't think I have rags. I think I... Okay, I have exactly one rag. And I'm not going to need this magazine for a while, so I'll leave that here. Alcohol, rags, and matches. I have all of those. Oh, I need to upgrade again? Son of a motherfucker. Well, that's not going to happen for a long time. Increases weapon dual durability. Definitely going to need that. What if this is a permanent upgrade? I'm gonna take that. If it's not a permanent upgrade, then that was just a massive waste of nails, because this thing's gonna break in 15 minutes anyway. Has any place around here been left unexplored? Not really. I've kind of uncovered everything in this place, and yet it's a new mystery every time. Not really getting too many answers. So. 
so... Oh, fuck. I gotta cook this, whatever this meat is, before it rots. does more damage, but it takes the same amount of hits, so that was a waste of nails. I mean, this is the first weapon in the game, so I don't really know what I expected, but... I guess now I just have to kind of focus on gathering enough shit to buy a toolbox. So, I wonder if I could throw a torch into that thing and set it on fire. I had to use my one alcohol to use that, so I'm going to be real mad if this doesn't work. I got room for some scrap metal. Two side trips. This is probably something I should do in the morning, because I don't know what... I think nightfall starts at around 8. So I got like fucking four minutes to do this. Your bullshit. I will have to try and kill one of those eventually just to see what they drop, because... Like I said, I'm gonna have to start selling some shit so I can get a toolbox. Damn it, I left it on. You. Shell? Fuck it, what is the shell worth? Okay, I don't care. I'm wasting time. Yes, I was right. You just burn it. Alright. Also, a torch is a weapon. I didn't realize that. Even though I'm pretty sure the game established that almost immediately. or pierce it with something? Like a torch? I don't know what that is, but it's worth more than a glass bottle. Damn it. 
was hoping I could unlock it from the inside. Apparently not. Oh, hi! Whoa! Whoa, buddy! Ah, he's got range on me. He's got some moves. Fuck. A staff? Sure, it seemed to work alright for him. Door code is 3333. Something tells me whoever wrote that note didn't come back. Alright, so I'm gonna unlock this door and head home. Because I feel like I got about an hour before nightfall. That boy gave me quite a start. Sure, I'll take a plank. I gotta repair mine anyway. I wonder which one of these is more powerful. Staff sure did a fucking number on me. But then, I'm not the one who died in that altercation, so that might not mean a whole lot. Nice and early, just the way I like it. Chain traps. I like how I don't need a chain to make a chain trap. Oh my god, I don't have enough nails. That is non fortunate. Nope. Eh. Honestly, this room is probably safer, considering it doesn't have a big op well shit. Where do I need to barricade it? More shit than I have. Because apparently things can just go through those. That might have to be my, my goal for tomorrow, though, is barricading that window. Because, yeah, just looking at it, I think that room would be a bit safer. Granted, there's only one entrance. And if something comes through that entrance, I'm a little bit fucked, but... At least it doesn't have this big, glaring, defensive flaw. gonna make a mistake because of OCD. Damn it.
Why can't this opening just be slightly too small for the wardrobe to go outside of on one side? I want it to be flush. So I have a very... have no arc to that attack. Not sure how much I like that. Oh, I can barricade doors too. I didn't even know that. That's definitely... should be one of my next goals. are quiet so far. <coughs> nope, I hear something moving. Don't you do it. Know what you're thinking. Just pacing back and forth. Hey, nope, 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 fuck. Alright, something's here. Something's happening. Oh, you, you dick! Get the fuck out of my house. I'll be taking your rocks in the morning. Actually, shit. No, I can't. I'm pretty sure the bodies disappear. So, I'll be taking your rocks right the fuck now. Is the body okay? If the body was going to be gone, I was going to be a little unsettled by that. That wasn't so bad. So far this night has been, uh, it's been pretty calm. This is night number five. I guess it's Friday night. Everyone's just kind of chilling. All these weird savage deer men are drinking alcoholized deer blood or whatever the fuck they do on weekends. Yep, I hear more footsteps. It's a dog. Why are you stronger than me? One drunk dude throwing rocks and one dog. That wasn't too spooky. I even got some rocks out of it. Now I have a ranged weapon. 
find rabbits, I can kill them and cook their meat. <laughs> I'm positive I've never seen a red sunrise. Alright, Saturday. Oh, it's raining today. Got nothing new to talk about. Oh man, this has to be good for something. I'm gonna see if I can cook this before I... Yep. I don't know why I would want to eat this random embryo I found in a giant pulsating egg in a burned down house in the middle of the woods, but... You gotta do what you gotta do. It's just the law of the forest. Take this from you. Really? Honestly, I don't need anything else until I get that toolbox and I can upgrade my tool bench anyway. I'm pretty sure I can't make an axe until I have an upgraded tool bench. Which means I'm gonna have to start selling shit to the wolf now. Anything else I want to give you? Not really. You got nothing else I need. You know what? I'll take this. Hey, level up. Able to see farther. Once a day, I'll be able to heal myself by standing next to a light source. Once a day, I'll be able to learn my current location on the map. Uh, I think I have a pretty good lay of the land. I'll be able to heal myself by eating mushrooms. But mushrooms give me XP, so I don't want to do that. I guess this is good if I get hurt during the night. Oh, what have we here? Oh, shit. Okay. We're advancing the plot here. Is this a shiny stone? Nope. Oh, yeah, it is. I hope I get to keep these. These things are worth a lot. Ah, damn. Video game logic does not apply. These corpses or branches? This seems like a real Hansel and Gretel situation. They are bribing me with these shiny stones. Armored door? Oh, I can't open that. I guess I better just leave. Is this the same door that was in the underground tunnel? I know that's the door I had the key to in the beginning. Thing that said 21 on it. I can hear a faint voice throughout the howling wind. It sounds familiar. It seems to be coming through the keyhole. Someone is calling me. Is it gonna be something spooky in the keyhole? Yeah, that's pretty spooky. Shiny stones, please and thank you. It's definitely not gonna let me keep those. They're giving me way too much money. There's no way they're gonna let me keep that. Oh, a merry-go-round. Nothing bad ever happened on a merry-go-round. flashlight die? No, I just turned it off for some reason. No 
Nope, staying out of the deep water. Uh, I'm just going to turn that off. corpse lamp disappears if you walk away from it. Oh, that's, that's a shame. Opening my inventory actually shuts off my flashlight. That's a little annoying. That it? Hmm. And no shiny stones. No reward. Damn. Oh. I have a shiny stone. It's not nothing. Actually, wait. I'm gonna sell that to the wolf. Let's see, do I have anything else that's gonna be valuable? That stuff kinda is, but it's also shit that I need. That is, and I won't need that for a while, but... Let's see, what don't I need? I really don't need to carry around matches with me. So what are these worth? Ten? Oh, five. That's nothing. Alright, let's go find the wolf again. Is it going to be dark all day because it's raining? He was by the burned houses. Okay. And then I guess after I do that, I'll head back to the uh, Silent Forest entrance and see if there's anything else in that house. Or maybe just check out Silent Forest. Seem to have kind of run out of shit to do here. Unless I start finding combinations for, you know, the wedding house and the burned house. But I get the feeling the way it's going to go is I'm going to go through the silent forest up into this place and then I'll end up coming back through here later on. Still full, right? Hey, Wolfman. You got nothing else to say? Okay. Here, have some of your cousins. Have this shiny rock. Wait. Okay, yes. Oh, I only need 200. Okay, I thought this thing was like 450, like the axe head is. So that's useful. needed the toolbox. I probably needed some planks, some wood. There's at least one other thing I needed. I don't know if it was scrap metal or what. Take some stones. Couldn't hurt to have some ranged weapons. I'm not 
not too concerned about. I feel like planks are starting to become kind of a limited resource. Same with nails. I'll check out this house first. If I die and I lose that toolbox, I'm going to be so angry. So, upgrade the tool bench it is. Like I said, I think that, I mean, that's just going to lead me to the next area, and I don't really think I'm ready for it yet. There's still this dog roaming around to the south of my house that I get pissed off at every time I go home and never kill it. I bet it is. No, oh, maybe not. And I forgot to turn off the fucking generator! God damn it! I'm so low on gas. these logs away. Alright, what do we need? Oh, just a toolbox and planks. I can just make some planks right now. Good thing I have a sawmill outside my house. Good enough. I have no reason to close this door. I have every reason to close this door. Not that I seem to be able to stop too many things from just breaking through it. I didn't sell that fabric. I think I just stowed it away. Okay. And then I stored rope at the burned down houses. So I can get an inventory upgrade. That won't hurt. I guess now that I figured out I could use a torch to to burn down that stuff at the other house, I don't really need my Molotov cocktails, but I guess it couldn't hurt. Though it just occurred to me that the only reason I really wanted to upgrade my tool bench was so I could make Molotov cocktails, so I could get through that house that I already got through. But we're gonna ignore that. We're just gonna pretend that didn't happen. I didn't put rope on the dog, did I? Okay. I knew I stored something back at those crates, but I wasn't didn't remember if it was the ropes or not.
effect. There's probably shit in that house I didn't pick up, too. Still dogs alive here. Poison mushrooms. Don't want to step on those. They just explode and poison you. Like mushrooms do in real life. Yep. So apparently those are just open windows. Close. Oh, hey, look, there's a lot of scrap metal here. And a bullet. So, I guess... I think once I get my inventory upgrade, I'm gonna come back, grab all that scrap metal, and use it to make some traps. I don't think I can make bear traps yet, unfortunately, but better than nothing. Got to do something to keep them off that wardrobe slash door slash cover for the hole in my wall. spaces I am moving up in the world and what do I need for traps okay I just need three scrap metal I'll have enough for that there was something There was something that I needed like eight scrap metal to make, and I don't remember what it was. Yeah, it was that, and I think I could really use that, but I don't have a pipe. So what I'll probably do is I'll use all this scrap metal I'm about to pick up to make bear traps, and then I'll just dismantled bear traps. I think you I think that's a net loss on scrap metal, but I'm not going to have a pipe before the end of the night. Of course I need scrap metal to make that fucking upgrade though, don't I? Regardless, this stuff will probably come in useful later. I should store it if nothing else. Ok, 
good to know I can actually come back here. Apparently I didn't leave anything behind when I died, so... point I can't really go anywhere. It's going to be nightfall in a minute anyway. And I'm pretty sure there's really no place in this part of the map that I haven't explored yet. There has to be something at that wedding I'm missing, though. Like, at least with this place, it like it's possible that I find the combination to open that door in here. I don't think that would be the case for the wedding. I think there's something somewhere in this part of the map that I'm missing that is going to give me the answer to that. I just know I'm going to step on at least one of these fucking bear traps. And watch, it's going to happen when I try climbing out this window as like a shortcut or something. Western approach, all right. I don't know why I keep searching that. What is the combination to that container? Look at that, I almost just forgot that bear trap was there. Put it up 30 seconds ago and I already almost triggered it on myself. Is 
see something try and break through that wardrobe now. Did my lamp move back to where it was originally? I'm doing good on fuel now, but it's sure going to be sketchy when I start running low. Nights already get spooky enough when I have lights in here, so... Shit going to get real, real bad if I start running out of gas. I guess that shit's kind of by design, because it's not like... Oh, was that me? Come on now. Um, it doesn't seem like any resources respawn, and there's only so much shit you can find and sell to the merchants to get more supplies. So it's... I think it kind of pushes you to progress. Which means I ought to just head for Silent Forest in the morning. out there. We got some nice bear traps for you to step on. <laughs> I should have barricaded those doors. sure you can just unbarricade them in the morning and still get your resources back. Oh, something's moving. Something's walking. Maybe they saw the bear trap and tried to go around. Go ahead, try the wardrobe. It's worked every night before, why, why wouldn't it work now? Come on. Every time I walk past that lamp, I accidentally nudge it and it creaks. And fucking startles me. Are you fucking kidding me? You missed the bear trap. You were supposed to step on the bear trap. You piece of shit. Get out of my house. Fuck off with your shit. Didn't even have the common decency to drop anything good. You missed my fucking bear trap. Waste all that scrap metal. Okay. Wait, did these pills not heal me? Oh, my lungs are more efficient. Yes. Yes, I can. Why have I never done this? Probably because I've thrown away all of my rags every time I've found them. 
that seems to have been a poor decision. I wonder if they can push it while I'm holding it like this. I can't believe that motherfucker just walked right over my bear trap. Oh, you... I've already had one intruder tonight. I do not need your bullshit. Come on, someone else. I would fucking rage quit if I... Stepped out there and stepped on my bear trap. This man who breaks into my house every morning. Take my usual mushrooms. May as well get some more scrap metal. A couple more boards couldn't hurt, but honestly, I, I have enough logs and enough gas to just make some. nails as I can get. It's probably a bit excessive. I don't think I need 43 nails, but... thing I was just talking about. Yeah, I guess I better get some boards. There's probably another safe house on the other side of the silent forest, so. If I recall correctly, I think I think I got to the Silent Forest the last time I played this game, and that was all I played of it. Wait, what? Didn't I just make some? Did they not give them to me? Or did I not make enough? Okay. Just doesn't transfer it to your inventory, I guess. Oh, for fuck's sake. I almost did it. I almost went and climbed out the window and probably would have landed on that bear trap. I guess I could have put this thing closer, but honestly didn't think they would be smart enough to avoid it. First off, let's remember to do that for the first time in fucking history. What? Oh, does the sawmill itself have fuel? Okay. 
that's great. I have even more resources to dump fuel into. But I guess I don't know if I'll be coming back here. Get as much as I can get out of it. stuff as well. And I know I got some shit over here I want to bring with me. I was just talking about how I need to stop throwing away rags, but... Sacrifice one plank for four batteries. Uh, that's one. It's one full bear trap. Do I want to sacrifice this staff? Sacrifice one rope for eighteen matches. Alright, let's go on an adventure. I don't know if I'm coming back to this house or not. I've sort of run out of shit to find here. Not terribly convinced I can find a combination for the house at the wedding. I mean, I wouldn't put it past myself to miss something like that, but... I did not find anything while I was there. Maybe I could have tried talking to the bride instead of just bashing her head in with a stick. I want to make a mod for this game that just replaces this man with the protagonist from Hotline Miami, complete with all weapons and everything. Just take all the horror out of this game and turn you into a murder machine. Make you the terror. Can I ever check and see what was in this crate? Apparently not. Apparently not! There was a Molotov cocktail in here the whole time. Wow. I kind of want it. I, I don't need these caffeine pills or whatever they are. Come on. Oh, cool. It was 333 three, three for both of them. 3333. Three, three, three. Sleeper? That seems to imply that this guy is alive. And that's not how you spell forest. Ooh, a hideout. hoard all the rare stuff and then not have any of the common I uh hi in the last hideout look for an exit beneath the floor uh thanks man I thought you were dead I'd like you to be Friend. It's just 
another dog. Just another dog. A, a huge dog. With special cookable meat that I, I'm not going to take. I have too much stuff. So. Beatrix house. There's something to investigate, I suppose. This place would make a good hideout. So when he said in the last hideout, I wonder if he means my house, the one I was at before. Or like the final hideout that I find later. Probably meant the one I was just at. God damn it. Still don't have inventory space, but there is a... M I mean, there's stuff here. There's storage. There's bread. Right, that'll be my weapon closet. This will be my resources closet. I think I should keep the nails on me. Don't really need matches, don't really need batteries, but I don't have room, so. Ration stamps. Hmm. So this game, this game obviously doesn't take place in America, because it seems like everything seen written down is in another language. Someone has attached a note to it. As soon as I say everything I've seen written down is in another language. Quick your tasting transport server. Fast and efficient. Call now. Is that all? Yeah, I'll take that. It might be something I can show to the wolf or the trader. Potato. And a crate that I need a fucking key for. Alright, I'm just gonna kind of prep this house a little bit, but then I'm gonna head back and see if I can find uh, an exit underneath the floor like my friend the sleeper was talking about. Fan belt. I wonder if you can actually make a vehicle in this, because I found fan belts, tires, car batteries. The basic components of a vehicle. Pretty sure that's all you need, nothing else. Hey, another sleeper? What up, bud? Ow! Okay. Fucking inconsiderate prick. Probably gonna go through one last night and then call it, well, a night for tonight. But let me talk to the wolf and see if I can show him some of those things I just found. Well, doesn't look like it. I can't sell him that, so that's probably gonna be important. Or, actually, I think he only buys weapon parts and meat, apparently. Oh, 
That's the dog that killed me in there before. I thought it just kind of appeared in there. I didn't realize it was actually wandering around in there. Because it appeared, like, right after I found an item. So maybe it just spawned in right then, but I didn't think it stuck around. Search for an exit in the floor. I bet it's that. That looks like something that goes to nowhere. Maybe not. That's just a hose. That's just the hose that, like, releases the gas that makes this house safe or whatever. Damn it, I really hope he meant this house. I mean, I guess if nothing else, I can gather up more of my resources to get to the next safe house, but... Kind of a waste of a day. Wishful thinking. Something in here. Some note. Oh, well. I guess I was supposed to read that <laughs> on the first day, instead of like the seventh or eighth day or whatever day it is. Oh, I hid that too well. That That's gonna hit me. Shit. Now it's too late to go back. I just have to sit here and wait for nightfall, I guess. Try combinations. Nope, nope, that stops the clock. Hmm. Almost had it. an exit in the floor. Wait, I can repair this doorway? Could I have done that this whole time? Alright. Guess he didn't mean this safe house. He meant the last safe house. my scrap metal back if I do that unfortunately. I would like to move that thing closer because I am tired of shit sneaking through this wardrobe. better be close enough. Shit. 
Okay, I need to not break that staff so I can get a shovel. I know the shovel head is like 450, and I don't think tape is too expensive. Okay, there's two different ways to make Molotovs, that's pretty cool. I should make another lantern at some point. Oh, fuck. Unfortunately, I've warded off all my exits, so now I have to go the long way, long way around whenever I need to turn the generator on or off. I should be trapping the generator room too. Like, I wonder if that's ever going to be a thing, is I'm just coming in and turning off the generator in the middle of the night. Because that would really fuck me over. Turn these off. I don't need these on just yet. just throw this at people. Yeah, sure can. This, for real, is our last night in this house, so I don't mind using up all the gas. I'm gonna hang out in here tonight. I had blanks. Did I put them away? No, I didn't use all those planks. I thought I had like nine. Am I just out of my mind? <coughs> I'm gonna sit here and watch. I want to see them step on my goddamn bear trap. Let's just drag this over by the window. Like, well, if they step on it and get out of it, then they'll at least have something of another challenge before they can get inside. Before 
spooky shit starts happening. Again, I am not coming back to this house, most likely, so I can use the gas. Oh. Hey, buddy. Oh, what? what? What's the matter? Is there something blocking your entrance to my home? Oh, come on. Give it your best shot. Are you? Yeah, that's what happens. That's what happens, motherfucker. Wow, did that just outright kill him? Awesome. I was fitting to start throwing rocks at this guy, but if that just ended him, then great. There's more, though. Let's see if this guy has anything to sell. Not really. Are you fucking kidding me? You just walk right through the front door, did you? I guess that's why I should barricade doors. Lesson learned. I was about to start talking shit, too, about how, like, they wouldn't come back because I left their dead friend outside the window in effigy. Apparently that wasn't true. How'd you get in? Did you come through the... Yeah, you literally just walk through the front door. Where the hell is the front door? Can I move this bed? I don't know why this is something that like highlights when I hover over it because I can't seem to use it in any way. things considered, that one wasn't too bad. Got to kill someone with a bear trap, finally, and 
know, this guy was kind of a pushover. A little angry that he got inside my house, but we made it to day eight. All right, let's see what you got for me before we call it a day. I don't know why I say that. We pretty much have the same shit every day. I do need one of these. I can always use more of that. And even you won't buy that, so I'm guessing that's an important item. Uh, how much? 450. Damn. I get 100 every day from this guy. So I guess I could just not buy anything and wait. Because I don't think I'm really going to find anything worth selling. Not here, anyway. I'll probably find some shit in uh, Silent Forest. I need that pipe. I think I just need the pipe for upgrading this, which... Ooh, now that I mention that, I'll go without getting some experience for the day and just upgrade that so I don't have to repair it as often. I don't have enough room in my inventory. Are you kidding me? Alright. And actually, do you have anything to say about... No. No, you don't. Anything in here? Just meat. So I think I've about got everything I'm going to take with me. I can make a pistol? That's all I need to make a pistol? Okay. That, there's something to think about. Oh, I can only upgrade this weapon once anyway, so... Oh, I need to upgrade my workbench to be able to upgrade it more. Hmm. I wonder... I hope the workbench at my other safe house upgrades when I upgrade this. Because if I have to upgrade multiple workbenches, that's going to be really annoying. But I think that's going to be a problem for later. For now, I'm going to make this fucking pistol and save that for a rainy day. And I think I am going to call it a night right here. So, thank you for joining me. This has been Darkwood, and I will be uh, playing this game again. Not Probably not tomorrow. Probably play more on Saturday. I'm going to be out of town until, uh, like, Friday night. So, have a good one, y'all.